What up? This is Rap Pitch. And so the game at WAC 100 got busted trying to finesse the courts because game owes this lady seven million dollars and he's only paid her 500k so far through music royalties and she wants the rest of the money so she went to court and proved that game has been withholding funds so it looks like she's saying that the game tried to sell his mansion to whack 100 and put it in his name and wax name to hide money so the court agreed with her and said that basically that woman could now put a lien on the mansion that will force game to pay her before anything. So he's either going to have to pay her off to get that lien paid off or sell the mansion or um, there's not much other options he can do. So he's going to have to pay her if he wants to stay in that mansion now. Otherwise, he might have to sell it. Uh, same thing happened with 6 9 a while back, but 6 9 was able to get uh, amendment to that. So he, he's getting time now to uh, fight those charges. They tried to make 6 9 sell his mansion too for a similar incident, but I guess he, he, he was able to get out of that and he has some more court dates now where he can try to resolve the issue. But with game, he's not so lucky. He's going to have to sell that mansion unless he can file some type of appeal. And really, the whole thing is kind of fool anyways because the thing stems from a situation when Game was uh, recording a VH1 show called She Got Game. And in that show, the woman said an incident happened with Game when he was drunk. And she filed some charges. This happened back in 2015. She filed some charges around 2016. And it looks like Game never really cooperated with the courts or tried to resolve the issue. So she ended up winning a default judgment. So he has to pay her $7 million based off of him not showing up to court. So this is not cool. Like, that's a serious loss, $7 million, because he didn't show up to court to try to defend himself. So now he has to pay her, and the court's going to make sure of it. Where at 100 tried to, like I said, jump in and help him. Put the he tried to tell the courts that the game owed him money, so that's why. Because the court was asking, why did you put the house, well, the mansion, in Wack 100's name? Wack 100 was talking about the game owed him money, so the game said he would put the mansion in Wack 100's name to satisfy a debt that he owed to Wack 100. But the court saw through that, and they said, no, nah, no. Nah. They said all oh, that's on hold. This woman got to get paid. They let her put a lien on the house or on the mansion. So any money now has to get paid to her first before anything can happen. Otherwise, they got to sell it. They said basically, you know, the, the judge wasn't buying it that whack 100. You know, they didn't care. They, they said this is this is the legal situation that takes precedent over you owing whack 100 for whatever reason, you know. So basically, they're saying the court wants Priscilla to get the money first before anything make sure she's paid off and then take care of that and then you can worry about whatever you want to worry about with whack 100 the court was saying like basically game is creating shell companies to hide his money and so now it looks like he's gonna have to actually pay her unless he can somehow get some type of appeal and that's what 6ix9ine was able to do 6ix9ine was in this exact same situation he was going to have to sell his mansion and cars for a situation with um, this woman. It was at a club where they're saying something happened to her with a bottle. She got hit with a bottle. I guess um, someone was trying to call 6 9 a rat, and he tried to get at someone, but sh this woman got hit instead, and, and she sued him. And so 6 9 was about to have to sell his mansion too, but he was able to f get an appeal on that decision. So... With game, you know, he, he's going through it. So, yeah, he, this could make him fall off, I would think. Like, $7 million, that's steep. I mean, how much money does this dude even have? I mean, that's like, that seems like that's probably all he would have. I mean, $7 million, I don't think he's that. He doesn't, he doesn't have that much money, you know. I mean, he, 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 he did well in everything in the music game, but that's like all of his money, I would think. I wouldn't expect game to have much more than around that so this is really gonna man he might be another struggle rapper after this it's gonna be a hard thing to come back from he's gonna 
have a hard time tra- trying to recover from this. I would I would expect because this seems like a um man that that's a play for that lady. She's she's gonna have all of Game's wealth for you know it looks like for a situation that she won and Game didn't even try to fight it. I wonder why he didn't try to go to court because. I mean, that's all he had to do. Or was he worried that, you know, did he not want to go to court because was there any truth to the situation? She's saying he was, game was drunk and, you know, um, you know, he, he, he was violating her basically. You know, he, I, I'm not going to get into detail, but yeah, you know, she said she, she felt uncomfortable from that incident when he was drunk. So it was on the set of the VH1 show and, you know, game didn't go up there and, and defend himself. So yeah, Ack is going through something similar with with a with a girl trying to get him. You know, but I'm a, I'm gonna report on that later. So make sure you subscribe and click that notification bell. I'm gonna get at you in a, in, a, in a minute with some more videos. All right, I'm out of here.